This is all wrong. I shouldn't be up here. I should be back in school, on the other side of the ocean. Yet, you all come to us young people for hope. How dare you? You have stolen my dreams and my childhood with your empty words. And yet, I'm one of the lucky ones. People are suffering. People are dying. Entire ecosystems are collapsing. We are in the beginning of a mass extinction. And all you can talk about is money and fairy tales of eternal economic growth. How dare you? Whoa, that was intense. I think she has a point. So that's Greta Thunberg. Greta Thun Thunberg. Thunberg. She's a 16 year old activist, climate activist, environmental activist. She really cares about the environment. That has a lot to say about protecting the environment. It made me think, as a dad, my kids are eight and nine years old. I don't know if there's anything that they're this passionate about. Maybe soccer, maybe baseball, but I really wanted to know what they thought about the issue of global climate change. And I know there's a lot of people out there that don't feel that there is an issue with climate change, but this isn't really a video about who's right and who's wrong. It really gives me chills just thinking about how deeply concerned she is and hopefully inspires my kids whose generation will be affected by the things that we do right now. Look who it is. Hey Gaff, I have a couple questions for you buddy. Mm -hmm. What does climate change mean to you? Climate change? It means when the weather changes. Mm -hmm. When it, like summer. What about global warming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Global warming. You don't talk about that in school? Do you care about the environment? Yeah, I don't know much about it. What environment? It was painfully clear that my kids knew very little about what was going on in the world in regards to climate change, global warming, and things of that nature. I decided to show them a video. What's up? Okay guys, so we're gonna start the video now. This is what not is a drill. What? Drill? My name is Greta Thunberg. Greta. We are living in the beginning mm -hmm. of a, a mass, mass extinction. Extinction. <gasps> extinction. Our climate is breaking down. Children like me are giving up their education to yeah. protest. What? But we can still fix this. You can still fix this. To survive, we need to stop burning fossil fuels. True. But this alone I got, will like, not be enough. Uh, not sure. Lots not like of sure. solutions Cars. are talked about. But what about the solution like that is right in front ah, of us? Tesla. I'll let my friend yeah, must... George explain. There is a magic machine that sucks carbon out of the air, costs very little, and builds itself. It's called a tree. A tree is an example of a natural a tree, climate like, give solution. Air? Mangroves, peat bogs, jungles, marshes, seabeds, kelp forests, swamps, coral reefs, they take carbon out of the air and lock it away. Whoa. Nature is a tool we can use awesome. to repair awesome. our broken climate. These natural climate solutions could make a Whoa. massive difference. But only if we also leave fossil fuels in the ground. It's a way. Here's the crazy part. Right now, we are ignoring them. What? We spend oh, 1,000 times more on global fossil fuel subsidies than on natural-based solutions. Natural climate solutions get just 2% of all the money used on tackling climate breakdown. This is your money. It is your taxes and your savings. Even so more crazy, right now, where we need nature the most, we're destroying it Help faster nature. than yeah, ever. Yeah, true, like, uh, like the carbon. When they, like, cut off the trees and build new homes. Much of the Arctic ice is gone. Most of our wild animals have gone. Much of our soil has gone. So uh -huh. what should we do? What should you do? It's simple. We need to protect, restore, and fund. What does fund mean? Protect. Tropical forests are being cut down at the rate of 30 football pitches a minute. Where nature is doing something vital, we must minute? protect it. Restore. Much of our planet has been damaged. But nature can regenerate. The California can help fire. ecosystems bounce back. Yellowstone fire? Fund. We need to stop 
funding things that destroy nature and pay for things that help it. It is that simple. Like see. Protect, restore, fund. This can happen everywhere. Many people have already begun using natural climate solutions. We need to do it on a massive scale. You can be part of this. Vote for people who defend nature. Share this video. Talk about this. All around the world, there are amazing movements oh. fighting for oh. nature. Join them. Everything counts. What you do counts. I say, I need you now. Is that all the fall from the California? I think so. Flat bit fire. So what did you guys learn? Uh, that if we don't care, take care of the planet, we might go extinct in the future. That's sad. Like it's really, sad. all the fire. How does it make you feel? Sad. Sad that those. He said that we're like making the earth bad. Wait, how? Wait. Pollution, gummy. Oh yeah. Fossil fuels. I kind of feel bad about myself. But and then we need to make more electric cars. What's one thing that you as kids can do to help the environment? By getting all the trash in the world and recycling. Picking up trash. Yeah. And don't litter. And growing stuff. Yeah, grow more trees. For air. And we could ask our teachers to tell us to learn more things about this. Yay! Yay! I got science today, so I can be a leader and make change. I hope so, guys. <laughs> yeah. Love you. Love you. Okay, so are we gonna all go out and stop driving cars and go completely vegan and do all these things to be a uh, climate activist? Uh, I, I, I don't think so. But I think what we can do as parents is is challenge our kids to start thinking about these things early and start thinking about things that are outside of their immediate life. And I think that awareness is very, very important in instilling really early on in their childhood. So yes, this video is a little bit different. No, I'm not gonna go out and buy an electric car today, uh, but I want to be a little bit more conscious about it and I challenge uh, you guys to ask your kids what they know about climate change and uh, just the overall environment and how things are all connected. I wish everybody the best. Have a great rest of your evening, night, day, whatever it is. And thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. 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 Love you. Wear your seatbelts. Thank you.